There they are. Oh no. Oh no. Well, that just made things a little bit more interesting. Zach, go. Is that dashing? Yeah, it is. Frick. Where can I go? I just want to make sure I can go up far enough to support Zach if he gets into trouble. So I can go here. Hmm. Okay. Moving to position. So Nina, you're moving over here. I don't know where those seekers are gonna go. Where are they? Where are they? Oh. 18, 16. Wow. Don't even bother. Just overwatch. Now. I need to remember that she's short range with her shotgun. Um, Zach, move up to the canister. Oh no! They're back there? I did not expect anyone to be behind. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Uh, can I get up? Here? It's dashing. Frick. Okay. It's okay, I'll just move here for now. Heading to that location. I'll take whatever shot I can. I sh- Ugh. That's a load of crap! Everything has gone wrong. Everything has gone wrong. Ethan, move up to a better shot. Hopefully oh, yeah. from here. Yes, good. Flank him. Now take the shot. These are not the guys I'm currently worried about, though. It's those floaters I'm worried about. They're trying to pull back. There's still those freaking seekers, too. This is not good. Not a good situation. Really? You chose to suppress me instead of shoot at Zack. Actually, Zack's not even flanked right now. Oh, now he is. No! Zack, no! Zack. You will be remembered. I will remember you, Zack. You know what went wrong? I just didn't think there'd be aliens back here. I didn't think this tiny little stretch of road that we did not explore would happen to have aliens in it. I thought they would all be- hey! I think I see a seeker here. might just be the green mist though. Well crap! Now there's no one to help me. Oh wow, this sucks. This sucks. Um, Janina. You can't really do much. Move up here. Ethan, move up here. See if you can get a shot. Any kind of shot. Crap. Uh... <sighs> Just smoke. Uh, you should maybe overwatch. <laughs> okay, I get it. I'm being strangled by tentacles. I know. Um, Ethan, I really need your help up here, buddy. Come on, man. All those years of friendship. That's Move up. You still can't see him. <sighs> this is just great. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna freaking die. 
Because there's still another Seeker. I'm just going to move Janina up here with Ethan. Overwatch. Aye, aye. Hmm. Yeah, just do it. Just dash that way. Yep. Yep, I'm dead. See, Zach, we're together already. How did you miss, Ethan? How did you miss that? <sighs> okay. Okay. Why is it only a 42% chance to hit? That doesn't make any sense. He's right there. He is literally like 10 feet across the alley from you. Oh my. Okay. I'm gonna move here. And try and take him the frick out. 51%. What is your problem, dude? Okay. We lose. I think we lose. We lose. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, Ethan, I'm making the call. We're getting out of here. Understood. You can't save her. You're just going to get strangled by the other Seeker, and then you're both going to be getting strangled. I'm dashing, so he has a defense bonus. Still gets hit. It's only one damage. Yeah, if I try and save Janina, Ethan's just going to end up getting strangled. And they're both going to be strangled, and I automatically lose, because he can't break free. I'm sorry, Janina. I'm, I really am sorry about this. But we don't have a choice. I'm on it, Commander. All these freaking aliens on Overwatch. At least this one missed. Run, Ethan, run! 40% chance. You suck, dude. You're freaking... You have no aim at all. I'm Just overwatch. Uh oh. Uh, I didn't expect you to hit, honestly. <laughs> as long as you don't get killed. Don't get killed. Ouch. And don't get strangled. If you get strangled right now, we're dead. Okay. Get out of here! Move! Let's rock. Abort the mission! mission <sighs> Jesus effing H Christ! Those floaters! Those two stupid floaters! I don't even think that was a mistake that I could have avoided making. I don't think that was, like, a decision that I made that went wrong. I think that was just just plain and simple crappy luck. It just did not go my way. The Defender's Medal. Really? Well, I guess Ethan was the only survivor, so maybe that merits getting a, a medal. Commander. We're in desperate need of additional troops. If we don't start recruiting new soldiers through the barracks soon... Never panic as a result of allies getting wounded or killed. Medicates and restorative mist heal 2 HP more when used on him. Never panic. Ethan's been pretty good so far with panic. Consider this, in the last mission, his three allies all got killed horribly. And he kept his cool. So... I don't think he's got an issue with panic, so I'm gonna just make it so he can be healed more. Defender's Medal. I'm gonna name that the Survivor's Medal. Ethan, congratulations. I know what you experienced was traumatizing. 
but you're a soldier, damn it. You will act like one. Oh, wow, that sucked. Myself, Zack, and Janina all dead. Me and Janina from stupid Seeker Tentacles. And Zack got shot down by a light plasma rifle. Zack and I never stood a chance. Janina did stand a chance if Ethan knew how to aim down his scope. Or not even scope, just iron sights. Not even iron sights! The Seeker was close enough you could literally just shoot from the fire and hit something. But nope. Oh well. One failed mission, which is gonna affect my score at the end of the month with the council. Um, Alright. I have... how many soldiers is that one? Two, four, six, eight soldiers left. Two of them are rookies. Alright. We can come back from this. We can come back from this. It's just a little setback. Yeah. Yeah. Well, as soon as that satellite uplink's built, I'll, I'll send a satellite over to Russia. <sighs> Experimental warfare. As we continued our research into the alien weapons fragments and the other materials recovered from the field, we've come to realize how the aliens managed to make these substances work in conjunction with one another. While reducing the size of these components is often a challenge in itself, we decided to focus our initial efforts on a weapon more suited to deployment on our interceptors. This cannon was designed to concentrate energy within a small target area, and should be capable of punching through the armored hulls of the alien craft. In addition, we've also passed a number of interesting conceptual designs onto the engineering team. Dr. Shen seems confident that, given the appropriate resources and testing facility, he can bring many of these concepts to life. Wow, look at all those. So... Reaper rounds. Experimental ballistics have led to the specialized conventional weapon load. It can cause substantial extra damage to affected targets, but the additional casing elements make it less accurate at long range. The rounds will not work with pistols, though. Foundry. Develop new combat items or improve current items in the Foundry. This facility counts as a workshop for adjacency bonuses. Phoenix Cannon. The Phoenix Cannon is capable of delivering massive burst damage, but its limited range puts the Interceptor at greater risk during combat. Flashbang. This grenade-style weapon emits a disorienting flash of light with accompanying sounds. Any enemies that can see the blast will be disoriented, suffering severe penalties to aim and movement. Robotic and psionic enemies are immune. So even if your allies caught in the blast, they won't get affected? It, it specifies only enemies. Interesting. Oh, let's do some autopsies. Let's do a sectoid autopsy. We've made a number of interesting discoveries based on the autopsy results of the alien specimen you brought back. The research team is now referring to what this particular big, stupid head you have. a sectoid. Such a massive, big, big head. Of its internal organs, which you made fun of in high school? I made fun of, of genetic you. Manipulation. Big headed As we've freak. Seen in the field, this species also seems to harbor some sort of telepathic ability. So I can telepathically make fun of it? I can bully it? With my mind? Because it'll understand my thoughts? Okay. Thermal generator's ready. Booyah. Beautiful. Beautiful. It's a beautiful. Thermal generator online. Good. Carry on. 